is looking at prison time after admitting to tax evasion. 60-year-old Al Hughes entered the guilty plea on Thursday in federal court. U.S. prosecutors say Hughes admitted diverting nearly $900,000 in corporate funds to his own account and not reporting it to the IRS. It cost the Fed nearly a quarter million dollars in taxes. Hughes had a hand in four Scranton funeral homes and Thomas J. Hughes funeral home on St. Anne Street. Hughes could face up to five years in prison when he's sentenced at a later date.